Okay, so we're going to have a little get measurement today. Um, measurement comes in four different forms, length, weight, capacity and temperature. It is a little bit of a tricky concept to understand, but lots of practical activities can really help you getting your head around what measurement is. We live in a digital world, so as many hands-on experiences as you can, just give you the skills to understand a little bit more about what we're doing here. Now, I've had a look in my home and I've found quite a few things I can measure with. For example, I have a tape measure. You might have one of those, you might not. And I found a Hello Kitty ruler. Woohoo! If you don't have a ruler, don't worry about it because you can measure using hands. This is my hand. It looks quite big, but it actually is my hand. And what I've done with this is a little bit of an experiment. So looking here at my sheet, I have thought of three different areas here. So what I think about measurement when actually I've used the hand, what I notice, so things you can see around you now, and what you wonder about, things that you'd like to know. So, I think that 15 centimetres is the length of my hand. I haven't actually measured it, but it's what I think. I also think the air temperature today is about 15 degrees. What I notice, I notice my hand is shorter than my foot, and I've also gone to our Weller measurements, and I know that Daddy Weller is the tallest. So follow me, I'm gonna take you upstairs, and I will show you exactly what I mean with my hand. Okay, so this is a bit of a, a family thing here where we've been measuring ourselves for years and there's lots of family and I can see here that Daddy Weller is the tallest. So that's what I notice. I wonder how tall is he? So I can use my hand. So easy peasy, start at the bottom and mark. He's hand one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I uh, say nine. Oh, let's go for about half. So nine and a half hands. Okay, great. So let's go back downstairs. I can also use my hand to see how long my sofa is. So I think my sofa I'm going to say 12 hands what I notice is it's quite long and I wonder whether it will be a complete hand or whether it might be half a hand or even a little bit of a hand so I'm going to measure here we go Is what you can do with the measuring the second activity you can do here I've done a little learning objective you need to find you need to estimate that means guess measure and then see how accurate you are with ten different things around your home I found all the different things that like weight capacity temperature length my feet in centimeters actually I've done another guess here I think about 20 there are, they are 23 centimetres, or one foot is. The difference is three. Any thoughts? Yeah, I've got big feet. <laughs> I've done the air temperature. I've done the oven temperature for my daughter when she's cooking. My oven is actually in gas mark. And I googled to see what the difference, the comparison is. Gas mark to degrees Celsius is actually 200 degrees. That's my thought. And I've got some more things to measure here. So you can draw your own table. Easy. Guess, measure, compare. What do you think? I hope that's enough to get you going with today. Again, if you don't have this, don't worry. You don't have this, don't worry. You should put... See you later, year two. And you...